you have to try this wonderfully decadent fusion ramen carbonara. The flavors are perfectly infused with a creamy texture and a spicy tang. First, let's prepare the eggs and parmesan cheese mixture. You will need two whole eggs plus one egg yolk. It's important that you use the eggs in room temperature. Now whisk well. Next, adding 80 grams of grated parmesan cheese, quarter teaspoon of black pepper, and quarter teaspoon of fine salt. Mix it well. And set it aside. Next, in your frying pan, adding 2 tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil. Set the heat on medium high. Then adding 100 grams of bacon that is cut in small pieces. Cook the bacon for a few minutes until crispy. Then turn the heat off and set it aside. Now we are going to prepare the ramen noodles. Boil a pot of water. I used two packages of Korean shrimp ramen. You can also use other kind of ramen, but this is my favorite. Remember to save this chili powder for later. Cook the ramen noodles in boiling water for a few minutes until just cooked, but still a little firm. Then drain the noodles and reserve some of the cooking water. Next, we need to reheat the bacon for a little bit. Set it on low heat, then adding the ramen noodles. Coat well with the bacon for 1 to 2 minutes. Then adding the eggs and parmesan mixture. Combine everything well. Be careful not to scramble the eggs. Keep the heat on low. Now adding some reserved cooking water to help you reach a nice consistency. Transfer to serving plates or bowls. Before serving, sprinkle extra black pepper, grated parmesan cheese, chopped green onions, and some chili powder from the ramen package. Do not skip this step. The chili powder gives you a fantastic spicy tang, which goes perfectly with the creamy texture. I hope you will give this creamy ramen carbonara recipe a try. It is quick and easy to make, and the taste is fresh, light, and creamy at the same time. You will fall in love and want to make it again and again. If you like my channel, remember to subscribe. I will see you in my next video. Thank you and bye!